Hey guys, it's Ebony. Well, Ebony's voice, really. Um, I'm doing a voiceover, and this is like the second time I've done a voiceover. And my voiceovers are terrible, but yeah, this is just some tie-dye footage that I put together. I recently purchased a ton of tie-dyeing supplies from Dharma Trading. And oh my god, I need to buy more because I'm so addicted. Um, this was just the first batch. The the first batch I did, I uh, used full ice cubes to do the ice dyeing thing. But later on, you'll see me use uh, completely pulverized ice like a smart person. Um, these are a couple snaps of the second time I did it. There, you know, some hats and some shirts that I wanted to. I already had tie dye, but it was like store bought, and it wasn't that good. Um, this is the result of the first two hats that you saw. There was a shirt in there, but I didn't show that. Um, here's all four of the first hats I did. God, I love them so much. They're so, so pretty. And these are all ice dyed. Okay, this right here is me and my best friend Katie who were in my backyard on my deck just tie-dying away, listening to a pop punk station. We were just having a good old grand time. Um, on the right, you see, well, yeah, on the right where I am, you see those four balls on my thing already. Those were actually hats that I, were ma I was making for someone else. And we started off bottle dyeing, but I wanted to use both bottle dyeing and ice dyeing, so you're gonna see later on when we pack some ice up there. But for right now, you see Katie just kind of going to town on her piece of fabric that we bought. <laughs> the, the two tan pieces of fabric were just cotton that we got from my local fabric store. I didn't mean to click my tongue. <laughs> Whoops. But you see, I'm being quite precise with what I'm doing <laughs> on my side only because these were gifts um, the first two batches I was a lot you know crazier with what I was doing but um, you'll see me go to town on my little piece of cotton and that towel on Katie's side in a few minutes so I'm gonna shut up and just let you guys enjoy the magic for you know a while so I'll be back And here is where we started the ice dyeing portion. Out of both bottle dyeing and ice dyeing, ice dyeing is definitely my favorite. And I wanted to use both methods because with bottle dyeing, you got you know a lot more color payoff and a lot less um, you know white or original color of the garment sticking out you know over time. But ice dyeing just gives such a really, really nice, just vomit of color. That sounds really bad, but it's actually super good. Um, it's very pigmented in the places where you put the most powder, and it just it just looks really, really cool as you saw in the pictures of it. So I'm just gonna hush, 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 hush my mouth and let you guys listen to this nice song. I should probably pop the song name up there. Boop, there it is. <laughs> If you know that band, uh, kudos to you. You're just as obsessed with Pierceville as I am. And these four hats I'm actually making are, were actually gifts for Pierceville. The other thing on my side, on my rack, was also the shirt that I wore to the show. I have a picture of that at the end of the video with the rest of the stuff. All right, I'll stop talking now. I might be back, hopefully not. <laughs>
Mr. Boo is going to be on snap. I'll just put a thing on there. <laughs> it's not. Yeah, I'm glad you're my best friend because my bra is definitely all the way out. <laughs> How do you feel, Katie? Um, I'm excited. Me too. Okay, and this was a few hours after they had been sitting on my deck for a while. And I just wanted to check on them, make sure, you know, colors were where I wanted them to be, you know, scrape off some dye where I didn't want them. Looks pretty, pretty cool. I really liked the way all the ice was melting so slowly. Oh man, it was, it's just color porn everywhere for me. And there's Snoop. He was upset the entire time because when I'm using, you know, just the powder dyes, he can't. He just can't be messing around with tie-dye in general, and he was kind of pissed. <laughs> the next day, I love this girly looking dye water. It's almost time to rinse these. So I said, I already rinsed in Katie. Things, my towel and my shirt, which looks amazing too. I will show you that that later. And this is how everything turned out. Uh, the hats for the guys and the two pieces of cotton me and Katie made. As you can see, even though Katie was very skeptical, hers came out bomb as fuck. I'm so jealous. I love mine, but I really, really love hers. Um, so that's it. I'm going to be doing a lot more tie-dye uh, videos most likely and projects so hopefully you guys are looking forward to that. Uh, yeah, I love you guys. Thanks for watching. I'm so sorry. I'm so bad. This, 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 yeah, I hope you enjoyed it. Okay, I love you. Bye-bye.